I'm not sure if you're ready for this question, but I'm going to ask it anyway. If you knew you were going to die, what would you want your last words to be? In this video, we look at the last words of a nation's leader, hero and icon. Joshua has fulfilled his mandate. He has accomplished his mission. He has completed his assignment. The nation of Israel have not only conquered Canaan, but now they possess and inhabit this promised land. It was a new beginning for the nation, but it marked the end of one who was born a slave in Egypt and who would die a hero in Canaan. Joshua would now give his farewell speech and that's what we see in Joshua chapter 23. In the first two verses, we are told that he calls all the leaders of Israel together. He gives a review of their past in verses 3 and 4. He gives a promise of their future in verse 5. And then he gives a responsibility for their present in verses 6 through to 16. The verse that I want to highlight today is verse 6. There it records, Be very strong. Be careful to obey all that is written in the book of the law of Moses without turning aside to the right or to the left. Wasn't this the theme all throughout the book of Joshua? The strength of the people individually and collectively came from God. When his people listened and lived out his word, when his people would hear and adhere to his word, and when his people followed and were faithful to his word, then they would experience victory, peace and blessings. So what would you like your last words to be? Let me know in the comment section below. And if you're interested in knowing the last words of some of the most influential Christians to have ever lived, check out this video.